Imagine a universe made of antimatter. In this alternate reality, the building blocks of matter are made up of particles with opposite charges, creating a strange and wondrous world. What would it look like? Would the laws of physics be inverted? Would time run backwards? Buckle up and let's find out. First off, let's figure out what antimatter is. We know that our universe is composed of matter. Matter is made up of tiny particles called atoms. These atoms are made up of protons, neutrons, and electrons, which together form matter and make up everything around us and what we're all made of. Antimatter, on the other hand, is just like regular matter, but the opposite. Just like how superheroes have opposite powers from their villains, antimatter has opposite properties from regular matter. So, while regular matter has protons with positive charges, antimatter has antiprotons with negative charges. Instead of electrons, we have positrons, and instead of neutrinos, we have antineutrinos. It's like the mirror image of everything we're familiar with. Now, here's an interesting part. When an antimatter particle and a matter particle collide, they annihilate each other and release a huge amount of energy. This is both a benefit and a drawback. On one hand, because of this property, studying antimatter is very difficult and expensive. We have to be very careful to ensure that antiparticles don't come into contact with ordinary atoms and don't annihilate each other. On the other hand, the huge amount of energy they release could revolutionize our lives. Perhaps one day, we'll start using them in propulsion systems for space travel. Imagine how amazing that would be! Scientists suggest that at the beginning of the creation of our universe, immediately after the Big Bang, matter and antimatter were equal. But this raises the question, where did the antimatter go? If they were truly equal, our universe would have been instantly destroyed before it could have been formed. Particles and antiparticles would have annihilated each other. Unfortunately, scientists themselves are not sure. They have a theory that the laws of physics were slightly different in the early universe, leading to an imbalance between matter and antimatter. So, after the Big Bang, particles and antiparticles began to mutually annihilate each other. However, for some reason, antimatter started to disappear. In the end, matter won. This process led to the creation of our universe. In the science world, it's known as baryogenesis. However, there are also scientists who offer more grandiose ideas. For example, a team of Canadian scientists from the Perimeter Institute for Theoretical Physics, led by Neil Turok, have proposed their own theory. They suggest that two universes were born at the moment of the Big Bang, our universe and a parallel one, consisting of antimatter. This is where all the antimatter has gone. According to this theory, at the time of the Big Bang, two universes were born, and then they separated. As the distance between these universes grew, the interaction between particles and antiparticles became weaker and weaker until matter won in our universe and antimatter in the other. But the most important question is, what would this mysterious universe made up of antimatter look like? You may imagine a universe where everything is flipped. The stars shine with an eerie blue light instead of yellow. Buildings are made of glass that reflects light in the opposite direction. And laws of physics work in the opposite way. After all, Antimatter has the opposite charge of normal matter, so isn't that logical? However, it's not that simple. Initially, scientists believe that this universe could be identical to ours in everything, all due to a property that used to be known as CP symmetry. The C stands for charged symmetry and means that each elementary particle has a twin with an opposite charge. The P stands for parity symmetry, meaning the symmetry of space, that is, all three directions in our world have opposite directions in the alternate universe. This basically means something like, laws of physics are the same no matter what the location is and what type of particle is being considered. So, if you were to run the laws of physics in reverse, or in a different location, or with different particles, the results should be the same. 
In simple words, scientists initially assumed that the universe of antimatter would be a mirror image of ours. It would be a pretty boring world where everything would be exactly the same as here. But in the 1950s, scientists were mind blown by an unexpected discovery. Neither of these symmetries held true. For example, if you take a piece of cobalt-60, it will emit particles that spin in one direction. But if you take the opposite of cobalt-60, the particles it emit will spin in the opposite direction. But they were expected to spin in the same direction. So what's going on here? Basically, it turned out that CP symmetry didn't work for certain weak nuclear reactions. The weak nuclear force is just weird like that, I suppose. This observation puzzled scientists for years, and then they finally figured out how to solve this mystery. They added another letter to CP symmetry, T, which stands for time reversal symmetry. This means that the antimatter universe, time must flow from the future to the past. In this case, the CPT property held true so it turns out that the antimatter universe would be a mirror image of our universe, but with time flowing in the opposite direction. So there may be a version of you in this antiverse, watching this video on your upside down computer, already knowing the ending. Isn't that crazy? So although this universe would look similar to ours, it would also be fundamentally different. In this world, things would unravel instead of coming together. For example, broken objects would come back together to form whole objects. People would age in reverse, like Benjamin Button, and apples would fly up from Newton's head back to the tree. This, of course, is all purely hypothetical. It's very difficult for us to imagine a world where time flows backwards. We can only imagine how surreal this inverted reality would look like. But this is what the data suggests for now. There might be something we don't know yet that would make the antimatter world different. But as far as we know today, it seems this is what a mirror world made of antimatter would look like. Scientists are still studying antimatter and its properties. Understanding these properties is important for a number of reasons. First of all, it gives us a better understanding of the universe and its origins. The imbalance between matter and antimatter in our world is one of the biggest mysteries in physics. Studying antimatter can help us understand why this is the case. Second, it would give us a better understanding of particle physics and subatomic particles. This knowledge can help us unlock the secrets of the universe and make new discoveries in physics. And of course, let's not forget about all the possible technological advancements. Antimatter has the potential to be used as a source of fuel for future space missions and other technologies. We could use this in propulsion systems to travel from planet to planet. We could also use antimatter in medicine, for example, for cancer treatment. Also in medical imaging, antimatter particles can be used to produce high-resolution images of the inside of the body, giving doctors a better view of what's going on. So, in other words, understanding the properties of antimatter is very important for science. It's a fascinating field of study that has the potential to unlock some of the biggest secrets in the universe. A universe made of antimatter would be a fascinating place. It would be very interesting to visit there and see how everything works. And the true nature of an antimatter universe remains a mystery, waiting to be explored and understood. But let's hope that we'll figure these mysteries out in the future. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.